Hello and welcome to another pedal demo by yours truly. This time I'm looking at the Honey Badger by Red Beard Effects. Now, if you're not sure who Red Beard Effects are, um, it's a kind of uh, offshoot of Thorpe Effects, Adrian Thorpe and Thorpe Effects. And uh, Mickey Demas from Skinned Red, he's uh, sort of thrown his uh, ideas and input into the uh, to Red Beard's uh, effects process, if you will. And uh, he's got together with Thorpey and uh, they've come up with, uh, well, it's only a small range of effects so far, but uh, what they've made so far is excellent. And this is uh, their octave fuzz, as it were. Um, if you're looking for a crazy pedal, basically, a crazy fuzz that will do octave, but it'll do a little bit more than octave, really. It does a, Well, it does an octave fuzz, but it does it in a, in a way that's maybe reminiscent of um, those old bro boss brown octave pedals but obviously you've got fuzz control here so we'll come to that in a minute so you've got two sections you've got the fuzz which is on the left octave on the right my only slight quibble on this pedal and it is only a slight quibble is i wish that the octave was a different lead color to the bypass um, it, if, it'd be, if it's sort of red for danger that'd be great but that's my only slight quibble with this pedal so yeah left is just for the fuzz arm right engage the octave if you go like that you've got sorry standby is now off oh, well. you just got the straight through sound to the amp and that's just designed for if you want the octave fuzz only when you press on the bypass you've got that so yeah going back to just a clean sound engaging the fuzz side only If you get into instant Tony Iommi territory, early Sabbath days, if that's what you're looking for, you can get it with this pedal. I love the bass control on here. This can be kind of addictive. You've got to watch it. I'm going into a large 212 cabbie so it can handle it. go flat out with it and it's a real what a booming sound this is the trouble control for me it really you can go extreme with it. Yeah. You really want to go really wiry and thin, fingernails on a chalkboard kind of thing. That trouble will do it, and of course you can back a bit out as well. I kind of like it near its centre spot. And the bass to taste. Fuzz side, that's in the middle. Again, it sounds great in the middle. Probably as much fuzz as most people ever need. Back it off a bit. It's almost like a distortion pedal. Huh? Give it a bit more. I really think in the middle though it shines in the middle. So that's the fuzz side of it. Absolutely brilliant. Over the top, you know, tweakable, useful fuzz. 
on its own without coming to the next session. You can hear that it's laughing in the background. That's my uh, eldest son Ben. He's on playing FIFA with his mates. So if you hear if you hear some shouting, screaming, and laughing, that's what that is. So yeah, we've got a global volume here as well. So let's just 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 tweak it that a bit. Split single coil sound. See, when you run to single coils, you might. Back that bass off a little bit, maybe. I don't know. Fantastic, very usable. The volume's great in the middle though. Fantastic. Let's move on to the octave side. For controls for the octave, we have got a, a knob called the device. This pedal doesn't actually come with any instructions that I could see in mine anyway, so I know not what the divide is actually meant to be, but I know what it can do. So you've got a divide and you've got an octave really basically controlling the octave fuzz side. As I say, the volume's global, no matter what you, you, you're playing through. So let's get in some higher. So I'm just set all, all controls, everything in the middle, both sides. into that what a fantastic sound that is so that's more your kind of traditional sort of octave sound really um, let's tweak the divide let's give it let's go flat out the divide <laughs> It gives it a more focused sound, which comes in handy when you start tweaking the octave, which I'll do now. We've got, we're about three o'clock on the octave now. So that divide, it really concentrates and seems to tighten up the octave. Now, dividing the octave are flat out now. Absolutely, it's almost like a synth um, synth sound. It's um, fantastic. Now that's kind of more familiar Boss Octave brand territory, but with acres of fuzz on it. So yeah, it, 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 its tweakability is absolutely brilliant. You can have fun with it, fun with it forever. But, um, yeah, finding an optimum position is difficult because there's so many great sounds in it. You just have to experiment. But um, that's no big problem. So that's with the, that's with everything in the middle and the bass just tweaked to three o'clock. That's a split call single sound now. Of course you can go up with a volume if that's not enough for you. Oh, 
what a brilliant pedal i love it so yes that's the honey badger by red beard effects again you know thorpey you know it, when thorpey collaborates you know it's usually a very very good side and a very good product at the end of it this is no exception i love it if you're looking for an over the top fuzz with an octave that will do more than just will do more than the hendrix thing will just get you generally play a genuine kind of octave pedal sounds as well out of it this is the thing i mean the honey badger is some legendary animal that's not afraid of any other creature on the planet it can battle pound for pound better than just about anything else so it's an aptly named aptly named pedal this the honey badger it's superb um i wish red beard effects all the best in the future really um mickey demas there he's looking he's looking to push the envelope there and do some slightly different things but it's also a pedal that he can rein it in a little bit so it still can rein it in to be a bit more uh, conventional if you want but if you want to go crazy it's all there so yeah the honey badger highly recommended if you want an over the top fours octave pedal uh just remains for me to say hope you enjoyed this got some out of it uh stay well people stay well keep well i'll see you all later bye